Hey guys, um, so, um, I'm super, super sorry that I have not been, like, pretty active, like, the past couple of weeks. Um, a lot has been happening. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, anyways, well, um, yeah, so, my birthday just passed, like, um, maybe like a week or two ago and like during that time I was like super busy and then um the week after that I was also busy um so I haven't had time to like really like make videos I guess and then when I do have time I like completely forget I have like a horrible memory but anyways and um yeah but I'm I'm back and I'm really gonna try to upload more videos like as soon as possible um but i actually have been like pretty active somewhat on my instagram page so i will like um leave my instagram name not my personal well you guys can follow my personal too but my makeup one and that's usually where i'm more active because like once i do my makeup like i'll put it on snapchat or something and then i like take a video and upload it i just forget to do a tutorial like i don't know anyways um but yeah, so this is just a makeup tutorial on this look. Um, I only um, video recorded my eyeshadow. I did not record my um, foundation and bronzer and all that stuff. Um, I didn't do my lashes either. It's literally just my eyeshadow and my brows and that's about it. Um, but yeah. Um, I hope you enjoy this video and like I said I'm really gonna try to have more um, videos up I'll try to have one up by another one by Sunday since it is like my last day of spring break because I am on spring break right now but um, I'm gonna try to have more up I would have had more up this week but I was like working some days and I didn't work today so I was like I should make a YouTube tutorial and plus my room was really a mess you guys like when I tell you a mess like it was so bad in here so I like went crazy one day and just like I just cleaned everything up and I like remodeled everything and I'm waiting on a new bed and so yeah pretty excited and what else what else oh and also I've been like going to the gym lately and so I went to the gym last night and I really hurt my back so I was like dying last night it was so bad but yeah anyway so this is just an eyeshadow tutorial slash brow tutorial I guess um so yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe and tell your friends about me and yeah I mean that's pretty much it again I really do apologize that I have not been uploading a bunch of like tutorials and stuff but I'm really gonna try to upload more like in the next couple of weeks and I can't promise you anything because I, I am a senior so like seniors years like crazy and I have to work like I just have to worry a lot of things but I'm, I promise you guys I'm really gonna try at least to have like one video every two weeks or something because I know I said like every week but it's just like I have just a crazy schedule but I'm really gonna try for real for real this time like I'm really gonna try to upload more videos so yeah all right well I hope you guys enjoy my makeup tutorial and like I said don't forget to like comment and subscribe and let me know what you guys want to see next and you know okay well thanks for watching enjoy bye all right so I already um, primed my eyelids and I used the Milani eyeshadow primer um, this is definitely like one of my faves um, and now I'm gonna go in with my Tartlet palette and guys I'm seriously sick every single like day of my life so my voice sounds really gross but sorry anyways okay so I went in with my flower child that's the name of the um, eyeshadow and this is just um, my transition color and it's just for all of the eyeshadows to just blend in you know really good and stuff so when you do your eyeshadow I recommend you start with a like base or like a transition color and just put that on top just so everything blends in really good and then I went in 
I believe with the eyeshadow called Sweetheart and it's kind of like a pinky color like a pink color and yeah it's super cute but it's you want to start off something with something light then I went in with the rebel eyeshadow and it's pretty much the same color it's on the same room just a tiny bit darker and yeah I mean whatever you do your crease you you don't want to go straight forward with the like really dark color because it's I don't know I don't I personally don't like doing that you want to like you know like do certain colors and mini eyeshadows and just build it up as it goes so now I went in with the darkest and that is the leader and this is the darkest um shade that I will be using so I just put some of that in and just blending it in and stuff so now um this is the mac prep and prime um fix plus spray and like I've told you this guy like this is amazing um, it's super, it makes your eyeshadows, like, super pigmented, and, yeah, I just, like, absolutely love it, and this pink eyeshadow that I'm putting on is the Clean Color, um, American Icon Wet Dry Baked Eyeshadow, these, I bought, like, so many on, um, my, on this website called Shop Miss A, and I actually did a haul and a review on these eyeshadows, and if you actually do want to end up um shopping there you definitely want to get these eyeshadows they're like on the very last pages but they are so good like oh, so amazing i absolutely love this eyeshadow and yeah so you just i mean like this literally i mean the eyeshadow itself is already pigmented and then you know with the fix plus it's super bomb so now i'm grabbing my toothpaste um eyeshadow palette i seriously forgot completely what this is called um but the eyeshadow is called i think i'm saying this right well i don't know arc de trompe i don't know but it's in french but it's like let's see the second eyeshadow from your right and yeah i'm just putting this on top of the pink um so it's not like super super pink more of like a peachy color and i did the same thing with the pink eyeshadow i sprayed some fix plus and yeah and i'm just letting it you know dry so after you do like your you know the center of your lid um you want to go back to the crease and again you want to start out with something slight so um i believe i got the rebel which is the medium shade and you just want to like go back and you know just like go back to the crease or whatever and also after that you want to get the leader which is the darkest shade like that i'm using and you just want to define the crease pretty much and then you're just gonna go ahead and blend oh god i'm so sick i hate being sick and recording my videos because i sound so disgusting Ugh. but yeah so you just want to go ahead and blend pretty much that's all i'm doing but yeah i really like this eyeshadow look by the way it's very like kind of girly i just loved it and now i'm doing my brows and i'm using the anastasia beverly hills um brow pencil in dark brown that is the shade that i use for my brows and i personally do not like like literally drawing on my eyeshadow like not my eyeshadows my eyebrows like i'm pretty sure you got you girls because i'm pretty sure girls are watching this i'm pretty sure you girls have seen like when like on instagram like those models that like their brows literally look so perfect like i just i don't know i'm not the type of girl like i just would rather my brows look like my actual brows not have them look like they're actually like drawn on like i'll fill in some spots like that are you know that i don't have that much hair versus other parts but i personally do not like actually drawing on my eyebrows that's i mean it's pretty it's pretty on some girls it's really pretty but it's just not how i like to do my brows <laughs> oh jeez i'm running out of breath so sick so now i'm just curling my um my eyelashes and that was the elf um brow curler not brow eyelash curler and it's i really like it it's really good and it's only a dollar like what more can you ask for 
So now I'm just using the Better Than Sex Mascara. This is hands down the best mascara ever. Like, I really, really, really like this. And I actually saw that they came out with a Better Than Sex waterproof one. If anyone tries it, like, can you please let me know if it actually works? Like, if it's actually waterproof. Because I really like this mascara, so. Yeah. So, now I'm using the Tarte Lights, Cameras, and Lashes um, mascara. And, yeah, I got this a couple of days ago, and I really, really like it. I don't u really use it for my top eyelashes. I mainly just use it for my long, or for my bottom lashes because they're, you know, they're, like, more tiny, and the, this brush is more tinier. And then for my lips, I'm just using the um, Revolution Makeup, Rev oh, um, Salvation Intense something. I don't know. But it's kind of, like, glossy. And then I just... Um, put on the NYX um, soft matte lip cream in Dubai. That's the name. That's the name of the shade. It's kind of like a dark brown, but yeah. So this is a final result. Um, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.